what's up, friends and family? How are you guys doing? Welcome back. I'm in there playing some more Final Fantasy 16 Ultima. Your ass is mine. Let's go. Joshua, talk to me, baby. What are we doing? You see, Clive, and us. At once into the inner sanctum. Planet. We are finally. I think this might be the end of it. We might be finishing Final Fantasy scene. It's within our grasp. We'll see. We need only endure this final trial, we'll and we shall together. Let's go. Woo! I'm excited. I've been holding this off for a long time, but here we go. Here we are. Here we are. Here we are. Here we are. We we are. know what it is that awaits us beyond this gate. And we shall face it together. Hi. It seems our hosts would rather we remain. I will stay them. We will stay them. Go! Just don't keep us waiting. Thank you. Joshua! Joshua! Wake up! Clive, is that you? This... This isn't stone here. Welcome to our darkness. A rift between worlds wherein your kind might reflect. Show yourself! Grave and many are the sins of man. And we would have you know them. All of them. As fate has seen fit to deliver you home, consider this our welcoming gift. Hmm. It would seem we are trapped. And the only way out is through Ultima. We find him and we leave. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Is it me or is this okay? About to say it's dark as hell. I can't see anything. There we go. Cool. Thanks. So Ultima's a big bad baddie here. I he's an interdimensional god being that wants me and my broder to finish off the world? Question mark. If you are to comprehend the full extent of your transgressions, we must go back to the beginning. When the world 
world was still young. We visited upon it a miracle, magic, and in its light did all life flourish. for this boon would prove heavy. A pall descended upon the land, painting the horizon black as night. Though we labored to forestall its spread, in this one endeavor we stood powerless. And so we fled, that we might endure, endure, that we might discover a means of salvation. But if it was magic that caused the blight, what of the mother crystals? I expect he'll tell us soon enough. See, like, why would you trust him? You know what I'm saying? Like, why would, why is this, why, why? Why would we trust the man that has been trying to kill us this whole entire time? You know? I don't understand what y'all two of y'all be, y'all should be like, renouncing everything he's saying since he's the guy that's basically trying to kill all of these, you know, money us. All of us, honestly. But Clive, for sure. And Jonathan. Jonathan? Joshua. You almost died too, bud. Chew. I would be like, you're a liar. You're you're lying. You're lying. <laughs> uh oh. Salvation, alas, was not readily to be had. First, we would require a land unvisited by the stain of corruption. An unprecedented journey lay before us one beyond the limits of our fleshly bodies. And so we cast them off. Thus stripped to our very spirit did we find our new paradise. A land as pure as driven snow, Valisthea. There would the true work begin, for the black crept yet behind us. And soon did we arrive at a solution, the illness having spread to every organ. There was but one escape from this fate, to start afresh. With a new world, the one for which Barnabas labored, a paradise free from the blight where his god awaits. our wills and abandon everything we hold dear, humanity can join him. So, Ultima would have us follow in the footsteps of the king. And follow we shall, for now. I mean, it kind of makes sense. <laughs> I know I was saying, just cast aside what he was saying, but it kind of makes sense. It feels like, kind of, but not to the fact that, you know, he's he has to destroy his whole self-being and whatnot. But to lose oneself in the fact that, hmm, that's the whole process of like free will. Do we have free will? I don't know. That's all this is about, the, the, the will to choose what you want to do in your life. What to forge a new world would require not only power, but a constitution strong enough to wield it. Acquiring the first would be simple. Untouched by the blight, Valisthea was replete with ether, and we had only to place jewels in her crown to claim it. Acquiring 
the second, however, demanded creativity. And so I cast forth the seeds of humanity. You created us. Is that not what gods do? We sowed the seeds for you, Muthos, all that you might one day blossom. And our future thus secured, we thought to slumber, though that would prove a grave mistake. For it was as we slept that man committed his greatest sin. He awoke. Alone in a world bereft of his god's radiance, he stumbled blindly, desperate for guidance. Finding no light, he sought to kindle his own, and from that single errant impulse was his will born. Having discovered himself at last, man turned his eyes inward and found he desired evermore that which only magic might afford. So wars were waged and brothers slain for custody over that dwindling resource. And the land, she wept tears of black. for this. Surely he cannot be so blind to his own hypocrisy. Not blind, just unwilling to admit the truth. But we are one and the same. Interesting. So the, that's, the, that's the whole point of it. That humans gain the, fa the matter of free will. It's like in, um, the Clash of the Titans, where the humans disavowed their gods, and they were like, nah, fam, don't disavow, y'all dead. And so they set off a blight. But the blight's already happening in this situation, so it doesn't matter. Ultima's trying to create a world where there's back to the just simple humans with no free will. It, but ignorance is bliss, so would that be better? Do I want to have free will? Oh! Is that... A freed? Or what's left of him? Long have our ashes lain cold for want of a spark. Cast your eyes upon them and see what you must become. <sighs> Valisthea cannot endure a second claim upon her being. The avarice of man drives her ever closer to destruction, but she may yet be saved by you. It is what you were born to do, why we nursed you and fed you as your own mother should have. And now that you are fully grown, our Muthos, it is time at last for you to serve your purpose. To right your wrongs. If our sin is wanting to survive, then you are as marked by it as we are. The fault is yours. Our wills were born because you abandoned us. And now, you would have us forfeit them for a place in your new paradise. Do you imagine yourselves worthy of one? Mankind has no place in our world. Is this truly so difficult to comprehend? We only 
ever require you, Muthos, when the time comes to bid this wretched realm farewell. None shall follow, none shall remain. What do you mean, none? This is our world. Once the land's rebirth is complete, humanity will have served its purpose. Why would we continue to suffer that which has caused us so much vexation? Because the land doesn't belong to you. It belongs to us all! What? That is where you are mistaken. You own nothing but your precious will. Brother. I can't do this alone. And you don't have to. I grow weary of your descent. Now you must learn that this master will not tolerate disobedience. My friends, my family, we have all suffered, all fought to survive. This world may be flawed, it may be broken, but it's all we have, and if we can't share it, I see only one other choice. You have to go. You may have created us, Ultima. This isn't your world anymore. It's us. power I forgot this is his this is his thing huh okay okay I'm doing work oh my god hold up I missed it! I missed it! Oh my goodness. I messed up so hard today, y'all. This is not good. Okay. Okay. So slow today. I am not. I'm not hitting anything today. And I missed. Of course, I missed. Oh, 
Help me, Torgo! I'm just trying- Oh, God, bless. Stagger him. Hurt him. Yes. Keep hurting him. Yeah. Stagger so forever here. Okay, here we go. There's something happening. Such foul attempt may not be sublimed through gain standing. He's strong. I'm not even touching him. Only with heads hung low is parents paid. Oh my god. Oh wretched mortals incapable what even? of contrition. Season, shall we our oh my god. Oh my god, help. Got him. I got him. Yes, yes. Hurt, hurt. Yes, sir. I mean, you might have hit me, but it's fine. Get him, Torgi! Get him, Torgi! Oh. oh my god! Okay, good, 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 Oh my god, dude! Hell yeah, that damage right there. That's what you call damage, baby. Come on, I thought I had him. Yes! Ooh, beautiful! I mean, I could've waited, but it's okay. God, nah, back up! Back up! Back up! Dargo, heal me! Dargo! Guys, I I'm, I'm I'm about to lose my power. I feel like this isn't even the final hit, too. Got him. Yes, nice hit. And I gotta do Zangetsu right afterwards. Got him. Yeah, baby. What a hit. That's damage right there. I think this is the third part of the boss battle. Got it. Goodness. Gifted this chance. And still you would raise your hand against the Lord. Oh my god. What now? The darkness bends. Oh, this is not good. Well. He means to end us. It wouldn't be the first time. Let's make it his last. Is this really how it is? This is pretty, pretty weak. Oh my god. Oh, mistakes. Mistakes. Mistakes were onto me. Mistakes were onto me. Oh my 
god. Oh my god. Ridiculous. Bro, why can't I freaking dodge his power right now? Okay, good. Got him. Oh, I got him. I can't even see him keep going. Oh my god, what is happening? He has all the powers of the world! I'm so dead. I'm so dead. There's no way. Unless I beat him in this last hit, I have no nothing else. Wait, I have the elixir. I do have the elixir. Behind you, butch. Got him. Yes. Yes. That's a hit. It's a beautiful hit, too. Yes. Look at that. Look at that damage! Okay, okay. Guys, I'm almost there. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. No! Heal me! Freak! Get a stick! Get up behind it! Get behind it! Oh wait, I'm in it! I'm ending it! I'm ending it! I'm ending this! Come on, Diamond Dust, please end it! Oh, he's staggered! Oh my god! That's it! This is it! No! Yes! Easy! Oh! Oh, that was closer than I thought it would be. Not gonna lie, he almost got me! You almost got me! Pole of Darkness, Dancing Steel. Holy hell, that was insane. Woo! What a crazy finish. What a finish. At last, for countless generations, have we awaited this moment. Your struggles have made you strong, yet your soul remains heavy with sin. Absolution 
is nigh. Repent, and all shall be forgiven. Tell me, Clive, how many lives have you saved since taking my name? Fewer than we have ruined. Wherever we go, we leave a sea of tears in our wake. These... these are the wages of your will, son. What good are our choices when all they ever bring all they will ever bring is death. There's no atoning, Clive. No matter how hard you try. So why not leave it all behind? Leave it all behind. Somebody save me. Won't anybody love me? I yearn, yet still she is not mine. Have I not given enough? From will is born desire, and it is this which consumes you, rendering you incomplete. Do you not see how the world bends and warps under the weight of your hungering hearts? What if it could all just go away? Just... go away? This is real. Wake up. It's time to go home, Clive. Clive. That's right. You're my brother. Brother. Once more, lest you forget.
My name is Clive. Clive Rossfield. Look, Ultima. Even here, the light of the vessel's will cannot be quenched, and the phoenix, his trespass should not have been possible, not possible unless, unless he has been with Muthos all along. The mark of the phoenix emblazoned upon his heart, made manifest by the power of will alone. The power of creation. Can it be? Are their wills truly so potent? Are you still talking? to wake you, but I think it may be time to leave this place. Eh? And once again, does my creation stray from the path laid before it? Steeped in conceit, you fancy yourself a god. You embrace Logos. But we will put an end to this hubris. What are you talking about? In the halls of origin, does our true power quicken. And there shall you be made complete. Soon, Muthos, soon you will discover how little you know of suffering. as it enters its final movement. 
stirring those long a slumber to wake you. And back to their origin. Crystals cracked, so where the hell are they? Oh, fuck me. Is that ether? What in good Grieger's name is going on? This is wrong. Are we back? Clive! Joshua! Jill! Is everyone all right? We're fine. What happened? Too much to explain here. Mate! We're leaving! Now! Everyone, fall back to the ship! I will be with you and none. Thank you. We're back to the hideaway. We finished Ultima, but he's not done yet. There's this big old mother crystal here. Let's go. I'm trying to figure out what's happening, guys. I'm confusion. I'm confusion. Let's do it. Okay, back to their origin. That's what Ultima I said. Tell everyone what happened to Drake's spine. Okay. And I'm going to need Otto's help. Back. Speak with Otto in the mess. I need a new. I need some items. I need some items, baby. I ran out of everything. Uh oh, a new item recipe crafting. Still alive, are ya? If you're gonna buy some, it'd be quick about it. Okay, I'm about to say. No way. No way. No way. Got the sun bracelet, channel whispers. I think I already have those, but maybe all right. All right, meteorite. I have a lot of that already. I do need these. I need. Uh, I need everything. I need to get here. I'm a rich man, so it's okay. I don't need to worry about it. The strength tonic actually helps, so I think. Rubbing me blind, you know. Is that it? Okay, cool. Let me see what else I got here. Sorry, team. I always do this after every big mission. I have to make sure I have everything I need to play with what I gotta play with. You know what I'm saying? Oh my God! The defender by itself is a freaking monster of a sword. What the hell's happening here? 
Oh my god. Those really? Crushes. What? What is happening? How is the defender a stronger sword than my actual strong s What is happening? Stormcry is there. Excalibur's there. Okay, whatever, whatever works. Oh my goodness. Okay, cool. Speak with Otto uh, in the mess. In the mess. Okay. So it looks like Ultima is God in this situation, and I am about. To, I fought God, and uh, I think I won. But now he is. Can you even see it from here? No, I don't think they're gonna do that. Are they? Are they? No way. There it is. Oh my God. That would mean the crystal is massive. Oy. There it is. Okay. That's God for you right there, buddy. He'll do that for you. Jeez it's Louise. Ago, Something tells me that I saw on the horizon is your doing. How'd you manage that? It's a long story. One that I'd rather only tell once. Right. All hands on deck then. Is this everyone? As I'm sure you've all guessed, the crystal which now commands the eastern skies was summoned by Ultima. He called it Origin. Now the significance of that name is as yet unclear. What does it matter what it's called? Its emergence tore Twinside asunder and wiped my homeland from the map. Mention of the Dominion Spires can be found in the oldest of Valisthian records. But to the best of my knowledge, none provide any hint as to their true nature that they would prove the horns of some slumbering demon. Well, the Dominion's demise was at least quick. Elsewhere, the Republican army cannot hope to contain the chaos engulfing Randalar. Canva is in flames, and the Empire. Our allies are crying out for answers. I've sent the curse breakers to give them what assurances we can, but right now that amounts to fuck all. They wouldn't be able to stop what the skies have started in any case. People here and across the realm grow sicker with every passing day. Could it be that this new Mother Crystal is like the others? That it draws upon the land's ether? It certainly looked that way from stone here. If that were true, it would explain the hastening spread of the Blight since the Crystal's appearance, would it not? As the land's ether slowly rises to the surface, it pools, corrupting all who cannot channel its energies. Arche above, ether floods below, and in the middle, here we languish, hopelessly entrapped. Faced him at Stone here. Ultima told us his true power quickens in the halls of origin. Needless to say, we cannot allow that to continue. If we are to stop him, we will have to find a way into the crystal. How are we gonna manage that then? It's up in the sky. And fast as she is, the Enterprise can't fly. It's a lot to take in, and I reckon we'd all benefit from some time to clear our heads. The answer will come to us. Don't you worry. Ain't that right, Clive? Right. That's right. Well, go on, then. Bugger off. So 
Same goes for you, Clive. You won't solve anything like this. Trust me. Go and get some fresh air, eh? Thank you. Joshua seemed upset. Hello? There we go. Okay. So it looks like this is gonna be close to the end. I think. I don't know. I feel like I've said this about a lot of the stuff that's happening right now, so I don't know. But apparently this Berserker, this Defender one, plus one, is stronger than my freaking Ragnarok. That's crazy. Ragnarok is one of the freaking insanely powerful freaking things that I have. That's, that's crazy. Alright, let's go. Let's talk to Josh. Joshua. Ultima may have created us, but he doesn't make us who we are. Only we can do that. And if he would have us fight for our survival, so be it. It's what we've been doing all along. Much like Ultima himself, it would seem. His new world being naught but a means to survive. And so, we must contend to decide which of us shall inherit the land. Should Ultima prevail, it will mean death for us all. Of that, we can be certain. But even should he fail, what world awaits us? A withered, godless place where our newfound freedom will most like prove a chain in itself. Well, there may be, but a chain can always be broken. As long as one has the will to break it, it won't be easy. It may take generations, centuries of suffering. And that is if everyone plays their part. But it will happen. And when it does, it will be on our terms. That is the world that awaits us. <laughs> Indeed. And what better world could one wish for? that crystal then it's a good thing I have wings you can barely stand let alone fly and only the founder knows what horrors await in those skies Are you certain about this am I certain I am the Phoenix I will do what I must this is our fight remember one shield that you are and what of my wings lest you forget you go to stand against a god I would not have you succumb to fatigue before the fight begins Ifrit your brother mentioned that some few of the dominants who had lost their power to you were still able to prime is that true it is. But their icons no longer submitted to their will. Ah. Then mine will have to be stronger. That you both might save your strength for the battle to come. You don't have to do this. If you do, there's a chance you might lose all you have left. And what have I but regret? My life ended in the Dominion. I fear death no more. Besides, 
I would have words with Ultima. He has much to answer for. We are in your debt, Dion. We can speak of debts when this is over. Speaks like a man who knows he's not coming back. And has come to terms with that. That doesn't mean that we have to, does it, Kaif? Time to talk to Jill. Damn. This is like this is like the calm before the storm. I have a feeling I'm gonna cut this episode as short as I can. But it looks like everybody's getting ready. This is the so final fight. Yep. yep, this is it. I think this, this is definitely the final fight. There has to be more. Can, am I even able to... Are they still locked? No, oh, they're available. They're available. Okay. Okay. Once I speak with Jill, I'm not going to finish. I'm going to finish this, and I think I got to finish something else. Because I need to get the final board. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Because I'm still not sure. Oscar. That some of my fellow guardians are to build a new home there. Hmm. Both for themselves and for Madame Martha's bed. It's true. I have many fond memories of Eastpool. When I was a child, I went to see on it. Oscar. My All right. It's beautiful. Shield. The flame. He's a powerful man. I'm a powerful man. I don't even know what the hell I'm talking about no more. Gav. I need to read these, these missives. I feel like a lot of these are important to read. Loss. Courage to fight. All right. I think I got everybody. Okay, cool. And then these. I don't know if I have everything. I don't think so. The Oath, the Hangman, Signboard, Martha's Rest, Guardian Scarf, Crimson Canvas, Skyboard, Sits Goblet, Ambrosia. Okay. All right, let's talk to her, see what she has to say. It's important. Let's go, Jill. Come to wish on a star. <sighs> that might not be such a bad idea. This is it, Jill. You know what I have to do. Why well, I have to do it. There's no turning back now. This is where our journey was leading us. Where it will end, for better or worse. I could pray to Metia for you. But you'll be alright, won't you, Clive? You always are. I did promise we'd watch the moon together. I'll be waiting. I'm guessing I'm going to say goodbye to everybody. Or at least talk to most... Oh. It's almost time. Okay, no, that's it. No, you're... Okay. Chiron. I guess you know this is poor... Hun. What is it? Torgal? Oh my god, Torgi! It's a quest for Torgi? Oh, absolutely. Okay, let me just finish this off and I'm gonna see what kind of quest we have before I even finish this because this is the last one, I'm pretty sure. Uh, not yet. Alright. Uh, everybody, a lot. Everybody wants something, it looks like. Okay. First the skies, then the crystal. Oh my god. I still don't understand. What do you want? Okay, I'm gonna end this episode here. I can honestly just add this on to the to the other one. I'm not sure what I'll do. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a like, subscribe. I'm in there. Peace.